to go work for us. Okay, so we give y'all guns, then he give us our people. And so our own people gave our people out in exchange for those things. Okay, so these Africans were got from all of West Africa, like Burkina Faso, Togo, Benin. Wherever the captives were captured, were marched on foot to a Saint Mansour to take their last bath before they were brought into this castle. Yeah, here in Palava Hall, the captives were branded according to the names of the companies that bought them. After branding them, then the males were put into the male slave dungeons, the females into the female slave dungeons to wait for the ships to come get them to the New World or to the Americas. Any questions? Okay, so we will begin the, the proper tour. Right where we stand is a cell, it, it's a condemned cell. There are some enslaved males among the enslaved Africans who were always ready to tussle. Okay, they took no, did not take no for an answer. They fought back for their freedom. Those who challenged the white folks were brought here to die. Denied of the basic necessities of life. No food here. No water, no light, no air. The idea was to stop, to suffocate, to dehydrate you till you die. We call this room the room of no return. Why? Because whoever went there alive never came back alive. Yeah, it was done so to deter other captives from making the same move. This is the only original door left in the castle. Mm. Yeah. We go inside there, but you watch your head. Okay. I know the watch. How did they get in here? They're safe. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> 